Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. Thank y'all so much for being here today. If you are new or returning, I appreciate you. And if you have not hit the red button, please go ahead and subscribe to the channel. So I'm gonna jump right into it because y'all, you see that over there? I'm about to can. So I'm gonna do this quick little haul just to show you a couple of items that I got from the Dollar Tree. I went in with the budget of ten dollars and I didn't really go over with the exception of the fact that she rang up somebody else's stuff and I just decided to keep it because it was sanitizer and we all need that so first thing I have here is this pizza cutter and I bought that because I plan to make some bread and I want to be able to cut slice the dough um, I bought this right here to aid in my canning process. And then I got some spick and span because I really need to give these floors a good mop. And I wanted to use that. It smells so good, y'all. It's antibacterial, so. I got these sponges right here. You can't go wrong with those sponges. You get like six of them for a dollar and they work well. Um, over here, I had to buy another comb, but I like the wide um, tooth comb because it doesn't break your hair out. And I don't know what happened to mine. You know, kids go in, they borrow your stuff, and you never see it again. So then my son called me while I was in there. So I ended up having to put back some other stuff that I had in order to get what he wanted because I was trying to stick to my $10 budget. They're always trying to make me go over. Anyway, <laughs> I'm just kidding. So I got these meal portions right here. And of course, these were a dollar. And it's two in a pack because he's preparing his own food as he is trying to buff up again, which is buff enough as is. And so over here, I got these eye covers because y'all, what can I do at the moment? I was trying to do a country farm effect by burning it a little bit on the eye and I messed them up. So I got some more and it comes two, two in the pack. So I bought two packs of those. And over here, this didn't come from the Dollar Tree. This actually came from the Bilo. There's a Bilo here in Columbia, South Carolina that is going out of business and everything right now is 10 to 40 percent off um i think their last day is february 7th if i'm not mistaken or 9th anyway this is a five cup coffee maker which i love drinking coffee but i don't drink a lot of coffee so i don't need a huge pot of coffee so i thought this would be perfect and i've been wanting one so this was 12.99 and i paid seven dollars for it so i can't beat that and that's it y'all for my haul so oh yeah what else did i get from the dollar store I got some sanitizer two things of sanitizer one for my pocketbook the little small one with the fragrance and then um, one to put in my husband's truck because he ran out and i didn't want to take out of our emergency room to put in his truck so i just went ahead and bought one so i got a dustpan because for some reason mine cracked in the center and no one knows how it got that way. And I think that's because they just didn't want to sweep the floor. So anyway, y'all, um, that's that with my haul. Like I said, this is going to be a quick haul because I have to can. I have everything set up. I did this all last night. If you're going to can, prepare the night or day or two before. Wash your um, items out. Even if you they were already clean, wash them again to sanitize it. And I, have, I don't want to touch them because I have to wash my hands. But I have my ladle. I have my jar um, picker. I have my funnel. And right here, I have my air bubbler thing. Now, what I don't have is the, magne the magnetic wand 
to um, the canning set. When I bought that canning set from Target, I think someone took that out because it was not in the box. And I just said, I'm not even gonna bother. I'll just order one and I never did. But I've been canning without it, y'all. They didn't have them um, magnetic wands back in the day when my mom and them was canning. So I use a fork and that's what I'll be doing. <laughs> You'll see when you watch that video. And then I have my water bath canner right here. And this is all been cleaned again. I always clean my stuff anyway, but it's all been cleaned again. I never take this off. I'm like, if it doesn't mess up, I'm going to leave it on. I'm just going to leave it on there. And so this is the little lifter that's inside of it came with it. It's a 21.5 quart. So I am getting a pressure canner. That way I can um, can meats and things of that nature, proteins. So y'all take care. Have a blessed day. I thank y'all so much for being here. It means a lot to all my new subscribers. Thank you for coming over here. And I hope you enjoy the channel. If there's something you want to see me do on this um, channel for content, let me know in the comments and I will talk to y'all then. Love y'all. See y'all tomorrow. You, me, you, me